Alright, I'm just going to make a video real quick on my iguana cage. I've had him for about a month or two now. Right there he is. He's a red iguana. He's a little cautious around the camera, a little confused. He hasn't seen the camera yet, but I'm just going to show you and just describe the cage pretty much. This is just a screen door, a basic screen door. You can see a reflection right there. And it's just special mesh coated stuff so it doesn't rust or anything. I don't want any rust in his cage, that would stink. And that's pretty much the whole thing that keeps him in. I painted it green. The walls looks pretty cool. I have a temperature gauge to the left and a humidity gauge to the right. Those are very helpful. Right down here. I have a warm mist humidifier. That's really good. I have it running 24-7. And right here is just a plain old shelf. I haven't done much with it because he's so small right now. But when he gets a little bit bigger, I'm going to make his cage have different like levels and stuff. Because he pretty much only hangs out on this level. Because this is where the lights are. Right there. That's the mic array. That's a heat projector. It's not even plugged in. That's my compact fluorescent halogen. So, I'll show you a couple of the fake plants I got up here. I got this plant. He hides back there a little bit. I have this plant so he can hide up on his log. I used to climb up right there. And he sleeps in here all the time. As soon as I put the lights on, like, start unplugging one at a time and wait a little bit, he just goes right in there right away. So that's pretty neat. And he has a tendency to go to the bathroom right in that area and then it just falls down and since it's been in the same spot I just put, the, put some paper towels on the floor so it's easier to clean up right there's some of his poo and just a couple more plants just got a small dish that I fill every day for him to sit in he likes sitting in that and there's some of his food it's all mixed up, and he's just enjoying himself in his cage. I'll give you a view of how big it is. Now this is what it looks like on the outside. Just a bunch of two by fours, and right up there, that's a section that's blocked off where I hold all of his lights. I got a power strip right there. It's pretty nice. So that's pretty much what it looks like on the outside. It's about five by five, somewhere around there, except for that little edge I cut off here. So it could be easier to walk through without smacking into it. But that's pretty much his cage and nice to hang out in there.